After analyzing the nickel concentration of the bath and determining how much replenishment is needed, the first method is to simply pour the replenishment component into the bath. It is best to pour it slowly with good agitation in the bath. If parts are present in the tank, you should pour the replenishment component away from the parts. In this example, we demonstrate the simplicity of replenishing with one plate single component electroless nickel. Second, you can pour the replenishment component into a bucket or other clean container with a small hole on the bottom so the replenishment solution drains slowly into the plating bath. This is a way to make sure the replenishment is done slowly and away from any parts in the bath. The third method is to use a replenishment pump. This can be an automatic or manual pump system. Given the simplicity of a single component EN solution, it is easy to use a metering pump as shown to slowly and continually dispense the replenishment solution into the EN bath. This third option helps keep the bath at an optimal concentration of all chemical ingredients to ensure top performance and stability. The flow rate of the pump can be adjusted depending on the size load of parts being plated. One important feature you have seen in this video is the ease with which the one plate single component goes into the yen bath. That is because the single component is pH compatible with the bath and the nickel is pre-complexed in the single component. These features one, avoid the harsh reaction normally seen when adding old fashioned C components to an electroless nickel bath, two, avoid the ammonia smell, and three, help produce a higher quality coating by avoiding the formation of nickel hydroxide in the bath.